Okay, after you've already practiced that other stuff for a while, don't go straight to this. Don't go, I want to rush through this and I want to get, I want to get the vowel phrases. No, stop. Take some minutes. Remember I said this is like a seasoned and a, an aged or fine wine. Don't do that. Spend the time on that. Understand the feeling, the support, the relaxation response. Don't just go straight to this. This isn't something you have to do in, in 30 days. You know, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna put an octave on your voice in six weeks. You know, that's not a subject for another day. Anyway, um, what we're gonna do is we're gonna go to the oo, o, and a first, and then we're gonna go through all the vowel sounds. So we're gonna go way down here. Hello. Want to just do oo and o? That's fine. Great. Right? You can do that too. Play with it. Spend some time with it. sensation. You really have to understand because as you're going and you're singing about your uh, phrases, when you go to sing a phrase, and I love you, don't you know that you're my darling, you know, you want to be able to like know how to get in and out of those phrases, not just be able to do a scale and hold, you know, a note, right? Let's continue. I consonants to deal with, we have air to deal with, we have compression to deal with, we have all kinds of things to deal with. So we don't want to go, you know, it, it, that's fine if we're over-dramatizing some, something. And in theater, which is they'll come to in theater, we want the back guy in the row, to, the farthest guy in the back row to hear all our word phrases, our consonant sounds. So if I, and so I love you, don't you know you're my darling? Right? We don't want to do that. If I'm going to do that in a pop context, here's how I would do it. Uh, you, don't you know you are my darling? Right. No. right. I want to be able to swagger in and out of the sound, maintain uh, the integrity of the note, but I don't need to over-exaggerate that sound. In fact, it's better that I don't, so I, I'm more subtle on my vowel transitions. Let's keep going here. So it's E, and so. <laughs> right? So I start and I rest into the sound, release to vibrato, go to the next vowel. Rest into the sound, release to vibrato, go to the next vowel, and so on. All right, let's keep going. I want 
want you to get that feeling of just relaxing to the sound. Okay, so that's the A flat. We're gonna come back down. sound, the oscuro, dark, covered sound, uh, to a pop, more of a pop or a modern pop or rock sound. It's the same feeling in the back of the throat. There's no difference in the feeling in the throat. It's the same. However, we bring some mask in, we bring some other things in that is actually going to give you a brightness with the same exact sensation back of the throat. Okay, here we go. <laughs> 